know some booties in Cali, they all be calling me daddy. I know some hoes out in Texas, they all be showing affection. What's up you guys, welcome back to the channel. If you are new, do yourself a favor, subscribe, hit that bell notification, come join the team, cause we getting baddies over here. All right, as always, before I start the video, bow. We still got some limited edition magnetic by mystic cologne, best smelling cologne. He gonna get in a long time. All right, so get it before it's gone. Also down below, if you are uh, going through something, first link in the description, book a Zoom call one-on-one. -on -one. Let's chop it up and let's get it fixed. All right, the reason you clicked on the video, give her space to chase. Uh, the problem is a lot of y'all, y'all are doing too much, right? Y'all are all up under her. Okay, let's say you guys are talking to somebody you're not broken up. You're actually either in a relationship or you're in the talking stages. You're vibing. You're feeling it out. You're seeing how it goes. You know what I mean? Seeing if y'all are compatible. Everything seems to be going smooth. But as predicted, like most women do, most all women, um, at some point, she starts to pull away. Not because she's, well, not saying not completely maybe it is because she's not interested or she's losing interest but a lot of the times it's a test you know what i'm saying she's testing you to see how are you going to react if she pulls away are you gonna turn in debatability <laughs> what's wrong sweetie i thought everything was good i thought we was vibing honey i don't know where the accent came from uh you gonna freak out or you're gonna keep it cool. You're gonna be Alpha Andy. You're gonna stand in your masculine frame and maintain your masculine frame and not change. Not turn into a lame. You just gonna be like, oh, that's cool. I guess just hit me up when you when you when you're ready to stop tweaking. You don't say this, right? This is just the vibe you're giving off. Okay. Now, a lot of times dudes freak out because, you know, they thought it was all good. They thought it was all peaches and cream. And now she's switching up. They think that she might be cheap, you know. Oh, she, she's into somebody else. That's what it is. Or uh, I did that one thing last week that she didn't like. And now she's probably thinking about it all the time. So let me bring it up to her. Hey, is it because, uh, you know, I uh, texted you that long paragraph last week? Is that why? Uh, beta. Beta ass can be. Another reason that they start freaking out is because they think, oh, uh, these are my consistent cheeks. If she pulls away, I can't uh, clap cheeks on a regular basis no more. My roster done dried up off of her. You start panicking. You know what I mean? You punani with my bruh. That's what that is. Be honest with yourself. Because, you know, I'll be on these one-on-one -on -one calls and a lot of y'all are giving me reasons, this, 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 and that. But then I'm like, okay, well, why are you telling me all these bad things? All these red flags keep popping up, but then you keep trying to justify, no, 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 like we got this connection and, you know, th there's no girl that does this and this, da, 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 da. And then you saying that you guys are having sex like three, four times a day. But you're whipped, okay? That's what it is. Once you clear your mind from clapping cheeks all day and you can actually see it clearly and and look at the situation from a different perspective you start to realize oh i was just hanging on for consistent cheeks because she was a freakity freak you know what I'm saying? Look, ain't nothing wrong with wanting to be with a freakity freak but if it ain't conducive to a healthy relationship she's not adding value to you other than that come on bruh now you simping out you're down bad, you're pathetic, come on. So this is why you have to give her space. She wants to, you know, act funny. You act funnier, you know what I mean? You turning into Dave Chappelle. You turning into Cat Williams, real quick. And um, yeah, you let her realize, all right, well, he's not gonna chase me. So either I get it together or he gonna leave for good. He's just not gonna, you know, feed into my, basically you pass the test. She does the test. She, she tries to see if you're going to stay strong, if you're going to lock in. You know, she might even like, she might not even pull away. She might just, you know, try to start drama. Just for no reason. Just out of the blue. Just everything's an issue. Oh my gosh, she didn't pick up your clothes. Oh my gosh, and why the toilet seat not up? You know, why the, this, why that? Why? Just why? Everything is an issue. Out of nowhere. Cause everything's going too smooth. She needs a test. She needs a little, little toxicity in her life. Women love that for some reason. But if you feed into it, you know what I'm saying? And you're always trying to fix things. 
Mr. Fixer, that's gonna dry her up real quick. You're supposed to be the man, you're supposed to be dominant, you're supposed to be leading her, you're supposed to be calming her down. So if you can be her peace, just like you know, women should be your peace, but uh, if you can be your peace in these moments, it shows her strength, it shows her stability, it shows her, okay, well, you know what I'm saying? If things hit the fan, he'll be the man. He got the plan, damn. Yeah, so you, you good, right? You're not worried about a thing. And then when you fall back, you doing your, your thing on your own. You letting her have her little freak outs. She's going to start coming back to you with a whole new attitude or brand new baddie because she realizes she can't keep acting like this. The test is over. You passed it with flying colors. Now she's coming back. She's chasing you. She's giving you that got got five trillion now. She was giving you five thou thou, you know, thou wow. But now she giving you five trill. She skipped a mill and a bill. She giving you five trill. She trying to lock you down for real, for real. That's why you gotta, you know what I mean? Chill out, understand, it's just a test. She backs away, it's just a test. She presses you about certain stuff, it's just a test. Yeah, you could address it. I'm not saying just go mute, address it. But address it from a calm place. How can we resolve this? How can we fix this situation instead of blowing it up even more? Cause that's, that's the problem a lot of you guys have. I've done it in the past, it doesn't work, it doesn't end up well, you know what I mean? And it damn sure does not make her wanna chase you. So, Realize you're the prize. That's what it comes down to a lot of times. A lot of these guys don't realize they're the prize. And then you start to be like, ah, I gotta fix it and make things work because she's the prize. And if she's freaking out, it must be because I'm doing something wrong and I'm not worthy enough of being with her if she's freaking out. So I gotta make sure she's not freaking out by doing something. No, you have to do less, remove the stress. But just like anything in life and dating, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's gonna take practice. It's hard at first because, you know, especially when you're in the heat of the moment, she's she's all frantic and this and that. You're like, yo, yo, chill, blah, blah, blah. come on, relax, come on, blah, blah, blah. And you over here raising your voice, you know what I'm saying? And the emotions get the best of you. But we gotta be men. We can't, you know, respond off of our emotions. That's what women do. So if you doing that, she's like, well, why don't I just be a lesbian? Cause at this point, you know what I mean? I feel like I'm dating a girl. But you're not, you're him with it, okay? Spray your cologne on, make sure she, uh, hmm, remembers your scent. And uh, yeah, everything gonna work out after that. <laughs> that is it for the video for the day. If you guys liked it, please do me a favor, hit that thumbs up button down below. Also down below, download Attraction Made Easy Masterclass. Book you a one-on-one -on -one Zoom call. Got you some Magnetic by Mystic Limited Edition Cologne. And until next time, focus on you and the women will too. I know some booties in Cali. They all be calling me daddy. I know some hoes out in Texas. 